Hi everyone, my name is Lisa Welch and today we're going to be, um, with the help of my fellow Secretariat members, we're going to be recording a video um, about proper parliamentary procedure. Today I will be role playing India as a delegate for the World Health Organization and later for um, the Food and Agricultural Organization. My name is Maya and I'm going to be chairing the different committees today, which basically means I'm going to be leading and directing all of the parliamentary procedure stuff. I'm Nissa. I'll be role playing Brazil, uh, first in who and then in FAO. Uh, hey everyone, I'm Asher. I'll be role playing China today. Hi, I'm Satvik and I'll be role playing Italy today. Hi, I'm Lucy and I'm going to be narrating the parliamentary procedure today. Hi, I'm Ben, and I will also be narrating the parliamentary procedure. Please notice how our names are filled out in the participants list. So um, for a delegate, the for a name, you'll be first your country and then the committee that you are in. Um, right now, I am the delegate of India and I am participating in the World Health Organization. And as a sponsor, you will be filling out your name as the Z sponsor and then the school that you belong to and then your name. And um, this is just so that you will um, file to the bottom of our list. And as a sponsor, please remain muted with your cameras off, um, just observing as you would at a conference. Thank you. Hi everyone, uh, we're going to be demonstrating basically what parliament parliamentary procedure looks like. Um, this is more of like an informal role play at the actual conference. We would be wearing uh, more formal attire and we would also make sure that our backgrounds are more cleared out. Um, but just for practicing purposes, uh, that's not really what this is going to look like for today. Um, so let's just get into it. The chair is about to start the committee uh, and she will call roll. It is important to pay attention and respond when your country's name is called because that tells the chair you are ready to participate and to count your vote. This committee is now in order. We will now take roll. When your country's name is called, please unmute yourself and respond with present and voting. Brazil. Present and voting. China. Present and voting. Italy. Present and voting. India. Present and voting. If you are having technical difficulties, please send a private message to the co-chair stating your troubles. If you get disconnected at, at any point, please attempt to rejoin and the chair will let you in from the waiting room. Afterwards, send a private message to the co-chair stating that you are present in voting. If there are any motions at this time, please raise your hand now. Usually at the beginning of committee time, someone will motion to caucus in order to amend or combine similar resolutions. Otherwise, there are usually not many motions before beginning to debate a topic. We will now move to our next agenda item, WHO1. Will the delegate from Brazil please unmute themselves to read their resolution? So, Mega 2 World Health Organization. Topic Zika virus, proposed by Brazil. Who? Concerned that the Zika virus will spread further in rural areas and during the upcoming Olympic Games and Anxious about pregnant women and health risks that it poses to the fetuses and noting further need for prevention through education and desiring to have available prevention tools, information, and care to pregnant women, especially in remote areas and for athletes during the 2016 Olympic Games and seeking support for the World Health Organizations from Doctors Without Borders Organization. One, appeals to the Olympic Games Committee to include educational public service announcements about Zika virus and Two, recommends UN distribution of preventative items. And three, urges having the preventative items readily avail available in rural areas and during the 2016 Olympic Games and expresses the importance for one to cover as much as possible and appeals to all countries and organizations to educate about the prevention as there is no vaccine nor treatment for the Zika virus. And six, fully believes that the distribution of preventative items and information will minimize the Zika outbreak and in rural areas and during the 2016 Olympic Games. 
After reading a resolution, the chair will ask for any points of clarification, which are questions that delegates can ask directly to the chair in order to clarify any difficult words or definitions. Thank you, Brazil. If there are any points of clarification, please raise your hand now. The chair recognizes the delegate from India. Please unmute yourself. Point of clarification. Proceed. What does um, the word doc or what is the organization Doctors Without Borders? Doctors Without Borders is an international organization that sends medical professionals to uh, places where people need medical help. Thank you. Are there any other points of clarification at this time? If so, please raise your hand. Seeing none, Brazil, would you like to speak for your resolution? After you read your resolution, the chair will ask if you want to speak for your resolution. While it is not required, it, this is a time you can build your case as to why other countries should support your resolution. You can write this speech before achieving arriving to the conference and practice it with your friends and sponsors beforehand. Yes. Proceed. It's important that we discuss the Zika virus and distribute preventive measures to stop the spread of it and to help uh, solve this issue before it expands. Thank you, Delegate. Do you yield to points of information? Yes. As a speaker, you can choose whether or not to allow points of information. This is a time when countries can ask questions about the resolution. Are there any points of information for the speaker? If so, please raise your hand. The chair recognizes China. What do you mean when you I'm say sorry, that- I'm sorry, you are out of order. Please state your point. When you address the chair, you must first state your point, such as point of information or point of clarification and wait for the chair to accept or deny your point. The chair recognizes the delegate from China. Point of information. Brazil, do you yield to a point of information from China? Yes. Proceed. What does the delegation of Brazil mean when they say prevent prevention tools? Uh, prevention tools can be everything from garments that cover more to stop uh, the spread of bites to mosquito nets and repellent. Are there any other points of information at this time? If so, please raise your hand. Seeing none, thank you, Delegate. You may yield the floor. Please mute yourself at this time. Since there are no more points of information, Brazil can now mute themselves and the committee will begin debating this topic. Are there any motions at this time? If so, please raise your hand. Seeing none, we will now set up a speakers list. A speakers list is a way to organize the debate. If your country would support the resolution, consider signing up to speak for the resolution in order to tell others why you like it. If your country does not agree with the resolution, I encourage you to speak against the resolution and suggest ways it could be amended. Remember, speaking against is a way to express your reservations about the resolution. Sometimes if there is no one asking to speak against the resolution, a chair might encourage delegates to sign up as a speaker in order to improve the resolution. If you would like to speak for this resolution, please raise your hand. Once we have typed your name, please lower your hand. If you would like to speak, oh, sorry. Uh, the, Italy. If you would like to speak against this resolution, please raise your hand. Once we have typed your name, please lower your hand. Uh, China. Will the delegate from Italy please unmute themselves and speak for this resolution? Yes, um, this resolution is very important as it not only addresses the fact that millions of people will be pouring into Brazil, which is experiencing a Zika, out, a Zika virus outbreak for the Olympic games, but it also addresses the fact that uh, pregnant women often uh, deal with 
birth defects. Their children often deal with birth defects when they are uh, infected with the Zika virus. And this, uh, this resolution also has a very effective way of preventing the spread of the Zika virus through the powerful tool that is education. Thank you. Thank you, Delegate. Do you yield to points of information? Yes. Are there any points of information for the speaker? If so, please raise your hand. Uh, the chair recognizes the delegate from India. Please unmute yourself. What do you mean? Can you tell what the delegate of India did incorrectly? Delegate, I'm sorry, you are out of order. Please state your point. point. Of the chair recognizes the delegate from India. Point of information. Italy, do you yield to, point, to a point of information from India? Yes. Proceed. What does the delegate from the delegation of Italy mean when they state that education is one of the greatest tools? It's because like, if you look into the past, uh, many treacherous and sad situations have occurred because people did not know about the current events and what was happening and what could happen. And if you use education, people will use their common sense and they will be able to control the spread of this virus themselves. Thank you, Delegate. Are there any other points of information? Seeing none, thank you, Delegate. You may yield the floor. Please mute yourself at this time. Will the Delegate from China please unmute themselves and speak against this resolution? The delegation of China believes that the Olympics do not uh, pose a serious threat for the Zika virus. And we also feel like the term prevention tools is too unspecific. Thank you, Delegate. Do you yield to points of information? No. Because the Delegate did not yield to points of information, they immediately yield the floor. Thank you, Delegate. You may yield the floor. Please meet yourself at this time. After one for and one against speaker, the chair will ask for any motions. Usually finishing the speaker's list, a delegate will motion to proceed into voting on the resolution. Are there any motions at this time? If so, please raise your hand. The chair recognizes India. Please unmute yourself. Motion to move to previous question. There has been a motion to move to previous question. Are there any motions that take precedence? If so, please raise your hand. Motions that take precedence are motions that are higher than a uh, motion to move to previous question in the list on the inside of the back cover of your handbook. If there are no preceding motions, we would move on to vote onto this motion. Seeing none, is there a second for the motion to move to previous question? If so, please raise your hand. Seconded by China. We will now vote on moving to previous question using the polling feature. Please either vote for or against. Right now, we are voting on whether or not we begin voting. We are not voting on whether or not to pass the resolution. This motion passes. We are now in voting procedure. Please remain muted. Please do not use the chat or private messaging at this time. It's time we will begin voting on the resolution. For a previous question, also known as the placard vote, we will use the poll feature on Zoom to cast our votes. We will now launch a poll to vote on resolution one. Please either vote for, against, or abstain. With three, four, one against, and no abstentions, this resolution passes. After the poll closed, the chair took note of the votes, and because there were more votes for, the resolution passed. We will now practice one more resolution. Uh, we're going to be doing this in the FAO committee this time, um, instead of the WHO, and I'm going to intervene whenever we see something new. Are there any motions at this time? 
Seeing none, we will now move to our next agenda item, resolution FAO1. Will the delegate from India please unmute themselves to read their resolution. Submitted to Food and Agriculture Organization, topic child labor and agriculture proposed by India. FAO, alarmed that children face serious physical threat when employed in labor and agriculture and disturbed that children ages ranging from five to 17 are, first to, are forced to work in agriculture and concerned that children who are working in agriculture are deprived of schooling and education. One, suggests to better protect the children working and two, recommends to get parent permission to create an international age requirement. And three, encourages parents or guardians to provide opportunities for children to receive an education and four, appreciates those who wish to help children, child laborers in agriculture. Thank you, Delegate. Are there any points of clarification? The chair recognizes China. Point of clarification. Proceed. Uh, what does your delegation mean when they say provide opportunities for children to receive education? Points of clarification are intended to clear any confusion, not ask a question. If you have a question, wait until the chair calls for points of information. I'm sorry, delegate. Could you, you're out of order. Please restate your point as a point of information when I ask for points of information later in the debate. Would you like to speak for your resolution? Yes. This everyone should support this resolution because um, children all around the world face serious um, face serious problems when forced to work in agriculture, such as those stated in the resolution, um, meaning that they are deprived of their schooling and education, which are fundamental to their development. Um, I ask that all delegations please support this resolution. Thank you, delegate. Do you yield to points of information? Yes. Are there any points of information for the delegate? Please raise your hand at this time. The chair recognizes China. Point of information. Do you yield to this point of information from China? Yes. Proceed. What does your delegation mean when they say to provide opportunities for children to receive education? My delegation um, means that because um, they are currently forced to be, or employed in labor and agriculture. Um, when we correct this mistake, we're going to provide them opportunities to receive an education at a school nearby or, or um, give them educational materials in order for them to help them receive their education. Thank you, delegates. Are there any more points of information? Seeing none, thank you, delegate. You may yield the floor and mute yourself at this time. Are there any motions at this time? The chair recognizes Italy. Motion to uh, limit debate to two for and two against. This is a motion used only when there is a press for time as we want to encourage debate and the chair can allow or deny this request at chair's discretion. But for Jay, we'll, we will show you how this looks. There's been a motion to limit the speakers list to two speakers for and two speakers against. Is there, are there any motions that take precedence? Seeing none, is there a second for this motion? Seconded by Brazil. We will now vote on this motion to limit the speakers list to two for and two against using the poll. This motion passes. Are there any motion, are there any other motions at this time? Seeing none, we will now set up a speakers list. Who would like to speak for this resolution? Please raise your hand at this time. Who would like to speak against this resolution? China and Brazil. Because there is a limit on debate for only two for and two against speakers, Italy will be unable to speak against the resolution unless the debate is extended. Will, Brazil, or will China please unmute themselves and speak against this resolution? 
the delegation of China believes this resolution should not pass because it is too unspecific. Thank you, Delegate. Do you yield to points of information? Yes. Are there any points of information for the delegate? The chair recognizes India. Point of information. Do you yield to this point of information from India? Yes. Would the delegate from the delegation of China support this resolution if it were amended to have more specific solutions? Yes. Are there any other points of information? Seeing none, thank you, delegate. You may yield the floor and mute yourself. Are there any motions at this time? The chair recognizes India. Motion to caucus. On what grounds? Um, on grounds of amending FAO 2 in order to improve the resolution. And for how long? Um, for 10 minutes. In China's speech, they pointed out something that they could possibly improve with an amendment. And India asked if they would support the resolution if amended. Therefore, India motioned to caucus to amend the resolution. During the caucus, all five of the delegates will work to improve the resolution during the next 10 minutes. There's been a motion to caucus for 10 minutes to amend FAO 2. Are there any motions that take precedence? Seeing none, is there a second for the 10 minute caucus? Seconded by China. We will now vote on the motion to caucus for 10 minutes using the poll. This motion passes. We are now in a 10 minute caucus. Please raise your hand to participate in the caucus. You will now proceed to the breakout room and the co-chair will come check on you and help you amend the resolution. A few moments later. The delegates decided to add the clause to the resolution that is being projected because it helped improve the goal of the resolution and specify its contents. After being amended, the resolution has to be re-debated from scratch, so India, as its sponsor, will reread it as the new resolution. Will the, re will the amendment sponsor please read the amended resolution? Submitted to Food and Agricultural Organization, Topic Child Labor and Agriculture, proposed by India. 1. FAO, along that many children face serious physical threat when employed in labor and agriculture and disturb that children ages, children ages ranging from 5 to 17 are first to work in agriculture and concern that some children who are working in agriculture are deprived of schooling and education, one, suggest to better protect the children working, and two, recommend to get permission to create an international um, age requirement on employed and potentially harmful labor in countries that do not currently have one, and three, the age should be set to 16 to allow for easy transportation and avoiding harmful labor conditions, and four, encourages parents or guardians to provide opportunities for children to receive education and five, appreciates those who wish to help children and lab children laborers in agriculture. Thank you, Delegate. Are there any points of clarification? Would you like to speak for your resolution? Yes. With this new amendment, I think the resolution, or my delegation believes that this resolution is um, stronger and provides um, more clarity to um, the message and the solution of this resolution. And um, I appreciate any delegate that is willing to um, support it. Thank you, delegate. Do you yield to points of information? Yes. Are there any points of information for the delegate? Seeing none, thank you, delegate. You may yield the floor and mute yourself at this time. Are there any motions at this time? The chair recognizes Brazil. Motion to move to the previous question. The chair is going to deny that motion, seeing as we have not yet set up a speaker's list. The chair denied this request because even though the old resolution 
was debated on because this is a new resolution uh, and it has new amendments, uh, we still have to debate it. So therefore we need to set up a speakers list with one for and one against at the very least in order to move to the pre previous question. Are there any other motions at this time? Seeing none, we will now set up a speakers list. If you would like to speak for this resolution, please raise your hand at this time. Italy and China. If you would like to speak against this resolution, please raise your hand at this time. Brazil. Will Italy please unmute themselves and speak for this resolution? Yes, sorry, this resolution should be passed because uh, now we have changed this resolution to include much more specific details to make it much more agreeable. And because we now have uh, more concrete details, we know the true situation and we know what this resolution wants to accomplish and therefore it should be passed. Thank you, Delegate. Do you yield to points of information? Yes. Are there any points of information for the delegate? Seeing none, thank you, delegate. You may yield the floor and mute yourself at this time. Will Brazil please unmute themselves and speak against this resolution? My delegation believes that while the expansions are a step in the right direction, we need still uh, a greater number of solutions, such as like improving agricultural methods to remove like the need for children to be working um, to, to fully uh, touch and solve the problem. Thank you, Delegate. Do you yield to points of information? Yes. Are there any points of information for the Delegate? Seeing none, thank you, Delegate. You may yield the floor and meet yourself at this time. Are there any motions at this time? The chair recognizes Italy. Motion to move to previous question. There has been a motion to move to previous question. Are there any motions that take precedence? Seeing none, is there a second for the motion to move to previous question? Second by China. We will now vote on this motion to move to previous question using the poll. This motion fails. Are there any other motions at this time? Since the vote failed, the chair will continue with the next speaker on the list. Seeing none, will China please speak for the resolution and unmute themselves? The delegation of China believes that this resolution should pass now that there is an age set of 16 years old, as we feel that protects children and also allows many people to work in our country to advance in other countries. Thank you, Delegate. Do you yield to points of information? Yes. Are there any points of information for the Delegate? Seeing none, thank you, Delegate. You may yield the floor and mute yourself at this time. Are there any motions at this time? The Chair recognizes Italy. Motion to move to previous question. There has been a motion to move to previous question. Are there any motions that take precedence? The chair recognizes India. Motion to divide the house. There's been a motion to divide the house. Are there any motions that take precedence? Seeing none, is there a second? Seconded by China. We will now vote on the motion to divide the house using the poll. This motion passes. We are now in voting procedure. Please do not use the chat, unmute yourself, or use private messaging at this time. This will be a roll call vote. When your country's, when your country's name is called, unmute yourself and respond with either for, for with rights, against, against with rights, or abstain. Brazil. Against with rights. China. Four. Italy. Four. 
India. Or Earth rights. Will the delegate from Brazil please unmute themselves and speak against with rights? My delegation reiterates that this resolution does not have comprehensive solutions that address all aspects of the re resolution topic and therefore it should fail. Thank you. Thank you, delegate. Will India please speak for the rights on this resolution? After being amended, um, my delegation believes that this is a strong resolution and um, my delegation asks for your support in passing this resolution. Thank you. Thank you, delegate. Are there any vote changes? If so, please raise your hand and I will call on you. When, you, when I call on you, please unmute yourself and state your previous vote to your new desired vote. The chair recognizes Brazil. I'm against to abstain. Thank you, delegate. With three, four, and one abstention, this resolution passes. Um, on behalf of the Secretariat, here are some um, few reminders to keep in mind um, while on Zoom. So after you speak, do make sure to mute yourself and make sure to monitor that you are muted when you are not speaking. Um, and another thing is after you raise your hand um, to indicate that you do wanna um, second a motion or be added to a speaker's list, make sure to lower it so there is no confusion later on when another um, task requires you to raise your hand. Finally, um, please make sure to use the chat only for given purposes and stuff that you would be saying at the conference. Um, and in the similar manner, please use private ma messaging in the same way as you would the pages system. We do, we are able to see any private messages that you do send after the conference. So please, please keep them Gemin related as you would with notes at the conference.